What's up Multiverse, Dr. Dave here. Welcome to the Geek Lounge. On today's video, we are continuing with our series of Naruto Kaio unboxings. That's right, I will be opening up at least one of every Naruto Kaio product I could get my hands on in a series of videos to close out the year. So if you guys are fans of this product and enjoy these unboxings, do me a favor and go ahead and smash that like button as well as subscribing and enabling those notifications to join me on this series. And as always guys, a little bit of information on these cards, on these sets, especially for the newcomers. You can also find some useful links in the description below. So these cards are an officially licensed product in China, licensed by Pierrot Studios, the animation studio behind Naruto, Boruto, and other popular animes such as Bleach, Black Clover, and Tokyo Ghoul, just to name a few, and are produced by a company called Kaiyu. These awesome looking cards started releasing back in April 2021 and new sets continue to be made in a varying degree of tiers and ways with different cards and pull rates dependent on the set you buy. If you guys would like to know more about these amazing cards, for instance, which box belongs to which wave and or tier, the cards you can pull in a particular box, the rarities, pull rates, where you can purchase the cards and much, much more, head on over to Facebook and join these two groups, the Kaiyu Naruto Card Collectors English Group set up by BAM Collectibles, as well as VTG's Kaiyu Library set up by VTG. TG collects for a treasure trove of information as well as to meet other collectors within the community. And without any further delay guys let's switch things around and open up this blister pack. Alright guys so what we have here is the tier 4 wave 2 blister pack, the fourth blister pack we are now opening up. You always get this LR card which we will check out in just a second. The artwork on the packs is of Naruto versus Sasuke, nothing else there as you can see, just the legal jargon on the back. Well I call it legal jargon, I honestly don't know what it says, all in Chinese, Naruto, Naruto, Shippuden, Boruto and Pierrot Studios as well. Four packs to open up, let's waste no further time and chop this open. So four blister packs to open up as I said before we get to that though let me just draft in the youth scroll box that I always use as my stand for these blister packs and X packs there are some sleeves because we should actually get a few more hits in this box if you haven't checked out the tier 3 wave 2 blister box I did actually get like, like I was very disappointed with it I only got one hit and then I got like three SSRs and two of them were the same. That's what annoyed me. If it was a different SSR, I maybe wouldn't have been so annoyed. But uh, I did almost forget to show off our LR card there. I kind of have to show it off in the light a bit more. It's, there we go, guys. Apologies. It's now gone into focus. You actually have the red light of the camera there as well. So there it is in the light. These LR cards you can only get in the blister packs. This one here is i'm assuming it's number four yes it is indeed of itachi there i am actually really adding to my itachi collection now you're guaranteed the same lr card um that like no different um on each blister pack so you get the exact same character per one they are still some of a hit though technically or like a um exclusive card so i am going to sleeve him up and pop him right there but yeah let's get into our first pack then guys as i said i am expecting uh, some slightly higher pulls because this is a tier four box so we should get more than we did in the tier three and we should actually get holographic cards as well instead of um uh, gb cards that we got in the last blister pack so we have here a common of Sakura, a common of Karin. We have an SR of Sakura. Our uh, holographic card is of the first Hokage, Hashirama Senju. I really like this one, but we did actually pull this twice um, in the last box, the tier four wave two box. And so our hit card of this pack is going to be an SSR, and it is of Sasuke. It's very cool. Again, we pulled this one in the last box as well, and it was actually in the uh, Tier 3 Wave 2 Blister box. It wasn't this exact card, but they were Sasuke cards, I swear. If they give me two of the same Sasuke SSRs again, I'm going to be really, really upset. And SSRs we also don't sleeve because they, they're just, they're, although they're like really cool, they're, they're not really considered a hit. UR is like the first hit in a pack, so that's why I, well, me personally, anyway, I don't sleeve them up. So we've got Eno here, we've got Iruka Sensei, we've got Shino as our SR card. Our holographic card is of Sasuke there with a the Jidori. We've seen this one a couple of times now. And our hit card for the pack is another SSR. Come on, man. SSRs, really? In blister packs, tier four. It's like, come on. 
You get these so frequently in the tier four boxes. What's the point blind? You just buy the blister pack for the LR card. As you guys can tell, I'm getting a little bit more upset now. It's still a cool card, but we did also pull this one you know, in the last box. And to be perfectly honest, the blister packs aren't super expensive, but I, I'd rather just spend the money then on a uh, like tier four box, you know, and um, get more hits. We've got like nine hits in what, 18 packs. So we've got like 50% hits. Uh, in the last box and then if you buy a blister box which only contains four packs and you're just getting the same SSRs it's like a little bit you know why anyway I'm going to stop complaining booze like these like trading cards collector's cards it is all just a, a gamble essentially right so we've got an SR there of Minato our holographic card then that's a cool one but we did also get this uh, in the last box of the uh, it, uh, I've done it again. I was about to say the Itachi brothers, the Uchiha brothers, guys, Sasuke and Itachi. Uh, it is really, really cool. So don't give me another SSR. Are you bloody serious? Really? Really? Three SSRs. And it's again, one we picked or pulled, I should say, in the last box. It's, it's just really annoying. And if this is only going to be an SSR, I have to say this is then the worst opening uh, like Caillou opening we've done on the channel, it's got to be something more than an SSR. You, you can't give four SSRs in a tier four blister pack. That's that's just beyond crap, to be perfectly honest. Um, yeah, you can tell I'm getting a bit upset. Give me something good, man. Right, so Sasuke, Iruka, an SR of Eno's father. Holographic card then is of uh, Naruto in Sage mode. And what is going to be the hit card here then? Thank the Lord. We have an AR. And it's a very, very cool one. An AR of Kaguya, Ka Kaguya Otsusuki there, guys. I'm losing uh, my voice and my words here. It is very late at night. Also with Black Zetsu there up her sleeve. I definitely don't have this one. And we actually finally finish a video on a bang. I've actually... Uh, you know, pulled a hit card out on the final pack for a change, but I don't, I don't know if it really kind of counts, um, you know, for these uh, for these blister packs, to be perfectly honest. But uh, yeah, very, very happy that we did at least pull something. Just again, a bit disappointing to get three SSRs. I kind of would hope, be hoping like for 50-50, right? Two hits and maybe two SSRs. But sadly, that wasn't to be today, guys, but I am really, really happy to have got that AR there of Kaguya. I always say these blister boxes are short and sweet. This one was like semi-sweet. The AR really did make up for it, but I did expect more than three SSRs, but it's just the way of the game, right? You can't, you never know what you are going to get. But yeah, guys, that is going to do it for today's video. So first and foremost, thank you so much for taking a little bit of time out of your day to spend with me here on the Geek Lounge. It is very much appreciated. And I hope you guys did enjoy the video. If so, be sure to give it a thumbs up. Drop some comments below if you guys opened up the Tier 4 Wave 2 Blister Pack. What cards did you pull? And as always, we have plenty more content on the way for you guys. The next video in this series will be finishing up Wave 2 by opening up the Wave 2 X Pack. So make sure you guys stay tuned for that. What is the easiest way to stay tuned, you ask? It's very simple. Simple, subscribe hit that subscribe button appearing down below enable those notifications so you don't miss out be sure to check out the tier 4 wave 2 blister pack as well if you haven't already otherwise guys thanks for watching today's video and we will see you on the next one peace out nerds